Hello friends all over the world. Hey, are you a civil engineer? Can you tell me the rules of column design? Sure, let's find out. 10 rules of ACC column design. Rule number one, choose square column if compressive force as actual of column section. This is the model of column section. And here is axis center line. And this is compressive force compressive force at right at axis center line so we choose square column this the length of column section and this the width column section so length equivalent width rule number two Two rectangular column if compressive force eccentric axis center line of column and this the column section and here the axis center line and here the compressive forces. The force and the eccentric axis center line. It's not right at axis center line, so we choose rectangular column. This length and this is width of the column section so the length over weight rule number three column height and width under 40 and width over 20 cm this the height of column this is the length of the section column and this is the width of column section. The formula height and width is under 40 is with standard width over 20 cm. Rule number 4 Main longitudinal bar is 4 bars in minimum and diameter is from 12 to 22 mm. Minimum 4 bars and diameter from 12 and 22 mm. Rule number 5. Distances of tile are 100 to 200 mm in standard. This distance of tiles are from 100 to 200 mm in standard. And this area about 100 mm and this area about 200 mm Rule number 6 If column is rectangular so main longitudinal bars are near the width of column This is the length of the column section and this is the width 
upcoming session. And this is the main longitudinal bars. The main longitudinal bars are near the waist of column. Main bar here. Here. Rule number 7. Concrete cover space of main bar is over 25 mm and of ties is under 50 mm. This is a column section. This space of concrete cover. Concrete cover of main bar over 25 mm, and this is the concrete cover space of tires. It over 15 mm. Concrete cover of tires over 50 mm. Zoo number eight. If column size have a prequel, so installation of starter diameter 6 or 8 length at least over 200 mm. Here is starter, here is starter, and here is starter bar for strengthening of brick wall. Rule number 9 Bottom of longitudinal bars must be dark leg to link with foundation. This is the foundation with starter of column 3 bar. This is starter of column 3 bar. And this area must be safe that lack. Rule number 10, just move on. Bottom of area equivalent of top area. It's the model of column which S as a area of column section. This is bottom section and this is top of area section. So area top is equivalent area bottom. And now we have summary of 10 rules. Rule number one. Two square column if compressive force at actual of column section. Rule number two, two rectangular column if compressive force accented axis and the line of column. Rule number three, column high and width is under 40 and width over 200 mm. Rule number four, main longitudinal bar R is 4 bars in minimum and diameter 12 to 22 mm. Rule number 5. This is the distance of time R100 to 200 mm in standard. Rule number 6. If column is rectangular, so main longitudinal bar are near the width of column. Rule number 7. Concrete cover space of main bar is over 25 mm and of ties is over 15 mm. Rule number 8. If column size have a brick wall, so installation of start bar V6 to 8 length at least over 200 mm. Rule number 9. Bottom of longitudinal bar must be dark led and linked to foundation. Rule number 10. Just simple one. Bottom area equivalent top area. Now, this is 10 rule of column design. 
If you see this video helpful, please subscribe, like, and share. Thank you so much.